Fluconazole, Wikipedia Audio Fluconazole is an antifungal medication used for a number of fungal infections. This includes candidiasis, blastomycosis, coccidiodomycosis, cryptococcosis, histoplasmosis, dermatophytosis, and pityriasis versicolor. It is also used to prevent candidiasis in those who are at high risk such as following organ transplantation, low birth weight babies, and those with low blood neutrophil counts. It is given either by mouth or by injection into a vein. Common side effects include vomiting, diarrhea, rash, and increased liver enzymes. Serious side effects may include liver problems, QT prolongation, and seizures. Fluconazole was patented in 1981 and came into commercial use in 1988. It is on the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines, the most effective and safe medicines needed in a health system. Fluconazole is available as a generic medication. The wholesale cost in the developing world is about 0.05 to 10 cents per day. In the United States the wholesale price is about 1.14 to 1 US dollar and 75 cents per day as of 2016. Fluconazole is a first generation triazole antifungal medication. It differs from earlier azole antifungals in that its structure contains a triazole ring instead of an imidazole ring. While the imidazole antifungals are mainly used topically, fluconazole and certain other triazole antifungals are preferred when systemic treatment is required because of their improved safety and predictable absorption when administered orally. Medical Uses Fluconazole's spectrum of activity includes most Candida species, Cryptococcus neoformans, some dimorphic fungi, and dermatophytes, among others. Common uses include Fungal resistance to drugs in the azole class tends to occur gradually over the course of prolonged drug therapy, resulting in clinical failure in immunocompromised patients. The treatment of non-systemic candida infections of the vagina, throat, and mouth Certain systemic candida infections in people with healthy immune systems, including infections of the bloodstream, kidney, or joints. Other antifungals are usually preferred when the infection is in the heart or central nervous system, and for the treatment of active infections in people with weak immune systems, the prevention of candida infections in people with weak immune systems such as those neutropenic due to cancer chemotherapy, those with advanced HIV infections, transplant patients, and premature infants, as a second-line agent for the treatment of cryptococcal meningoencephalitis, a fungal infection of the central nervous system. In C. albicans, resistance occurs by way of mutations in the ERG11 gene, which codes for 1,4-alpha dimethylase. These mutations prevent the azole drug from binding, while still allowing binding of the enzyme's natural substrate, lanosterol. Development of resistance to one azole in this way will confer resistance to all drugs in the class. Another resistance mechanism employed by both C. albicans and C. glabrata is increasing the rate of efflux of the azole drug from the cell, by both ADP binding cassette and major facilitator superfamily transporters. Other gene mutations are also known to contribute to development of resistance. C. glabrata develops resistance by upregulating CDR genes and resistance in C. cruzae is mediated by reduced sensitivity of the target enzyme to inhibition by the agent. The full spectrum of fungal susceptibility and resistance to fluconazole can be found in the TOKU ES product data sheet. According to the United States Centers for Disease Control, 
fluconazole resistance among candida strains in the U.S. is about 7%. Fluconazole is contraindicated in patients who Adverse drug reactions associated with fluconazole therapy include If taken during pregnancy it may result in harm. These cases of harm, however, were only in women who took large doses for most of the first trimester. It is of the triazole class. Have known hypersensitivity to other azole medicines such as ketoconazole, are taking terfenidine, if 400 mg per day multidose of fluconazole is administered, concomitant administration of fluconazole and quinidine, especially when fluconazole is administered in high dosages, take SSRIs such as floxidin or sertraline. Fluconazole is secreted in human milk at concentrations similar to plasma. Therefore, the use of fluconazole in lactating mothers is not recommended. Fluconazole therapy has been associated with QT interval prolongation, which may lead to serious cardiac arrhythmias. Thus, it is used with caution in patients with risk factors for prolonged QT interval, such as electrolyte imbalance or use of other drugs that may prolong the QT interval. Common Rash, headache, dizziness, nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, diarrhea, and slash or elevated liver enzymes, infrequent, anorexia, fatigue, constipation, rare, oliguria, hypokalemia, paresthesia, seizures, alopecia, Stevens Johnson syndrome, thrombocytopenia. Other blood dyscrasias, serious hepatotoxicity including liver failure, anaphylactic slash anaphylactoid reactions, very rare, prolonged QT interval, torsades de points, FDA is now saying treatment with chronic, high doses of fluconazole during. The first trimester of pregnancy may be associated with a rare and distinct set of birth defects in infants. Resistance Fluconazole has also rarely been associated with severe or lethal hepatotoxicity, so liver function tests are usually performed regularly during prolonged fluconazole therapy. In addition, it is used with caution in patients with pre-existing liver disease. Some people are allergic to azoles so those allergic to other azole drugs might be allergic to fluconazole. That is, some azole drugs have adverse side effects. Some azole drugs may disrupt estrogen production in pregnancy, affecting pregnancy outcome. Fluconazole taken at low doses is in FDA pregnancy category C. However, High doses have been associated with a rare and distinct set of birth defects in infants. If taken at these doses, the pregnancy category is changed from category C to category D. Pregnancy category D means there is positive evidence of human fetal risk based on human data. In some cases, the potential benefits from use of the drug in pregnant women with serious or life-threatening conditions may be acceptable despite its risks. Fluconazole should not be taken during pregnancy or if one could become pregnant during treatment without first consulting a doctor. Oral fluconazole is not associated with a significantly increased risk of birth defects overall although it does increase the odds ratio of tetralogy of phthalate, but the absolute risk is still low. Women using fluconazole during pregnancy have a 50% higher risk of spontaneous abortion. Fluconazole should not be taken with cisapride due to the possibility of serious, even fatal, heart problems. In rare cases, Severe allergic reactions including anaphylaxis may occur. Powder for oral suspension contains sucrose and should not be used in patients with hereditary fructose, 
glucose slash galactose malabsorption or sucrase isomaltase deficiency. Capsules contain lactose and should not be given to patients with rare hereditary problems of galactose intolerance, lap lactase deficiency, or glucose galactose malabsorption. Fluconazole is an inhibitor of the human cytochrome P450 system, particularly the isozyme CYP2C19 in theory, therefore, fluconazole decreases the metabolism and increases the concentration of any drug metabolized by these enzymes. In addition, its potential effect on QT interval increases the risk of cardiac arrhythmia if used concurrently with other drugs that prolong the QT interval. Berberine has been shown to exert synergistic effects with fluconazole even in drug-resistant Candida albicans infections. Fluconazole may decrease the metabolism of benzodiazepines. Fluconazole may increase the serum concentration of cytolopram. Fluconazole may increase the serum concentration of erythromycin. Like other imidazole and triazole class antifungals, fluconazole inhibits the fungal cytochrome P450 enzyme 1,4-alpha dimethylase. Mammalian demethylase activity is much less sensitive to fluconazole than fungal demethylase. This inhibition prevents the conversion of lanosterol to ergosterol, an essential component of the fungal cytoplasmic membrane, and subsequent accumulation of 1,4-alpha-methylsterols. Fluconazole is primarily fungistatic, however. It may be fungicidal against certain organisms in a dose-dependent manner, specifically Cryptococcus. Contraindications Adverse effects Following oral dosing, fluconazole is almost completely absorbed within two hours. Bioavailability is not significantly affected by the absence of stomach acid. Concentrations measured in the urine, tears, and skin are approximately 10 times the plasma concentration, whereas saliva, sputum, and vaginal fluid concentrations are approximately equal to the plasma concentration, following a standard dose range of between 100 mg and 400 mg per day. The elimination half-life of fluconazole follows zero-order kinetics and only 10% of elimination is due to metabolism, the remainder being excreted in urine and sweat. Patients with impaired renal function will be at risk of overdose. Drug Interactions Mechanism of Action Pharmacokinetics History In a bulk powder form, it appears as a white crystalline powder and it is very slightly soluble in water and soluble in alcohol. Fluconazole was patented by Pfizer in 1981 in the United Kingdom and came into commercial use in 1988. 